Hello everyone, welcome to the YouTube channel, it's I, the Great Mirror Fazbear, and today I'm going to tell you all ways how to survive Jane and Jeff the Killer. Make sure to like and subscribe, here we go. If you see a boy holding a knife at the edge of the woods, don't go there, run the other way, because Jeff is extremely fast. Number two, don't look for Jeff the Killer during a full moon, because... It's an extreme bad idea, plus he is too fast. Number three, don't make waffles after midnight. Jeff the Killer is extremely addictive to waffles like Tiki Toby. So if Jeff the Killer smells you making waffles, immediately walks towards where the waffles are being made. You'll see him holding a knife in front of you while you're making the waffles. Number four, don't call Jeff the Killer during a full moon or not a full moon. Lock up all your doors, windows, and stay in your room until 4 a.m. Do not open the door no matter what. Okay, so that is Jeff the Killer. Here is Jane the Killer. If you want to call Jane the Killer, block and lock up all your doors, windows, until 4 a.m. Do not open the door no matter what. Or no matter what you see. Number three, don't go looking for Jane the Killer during a full moon because it is a bad idea because Jane the Killer is extremely fast, like Jeff. Third and final one. If you see a teenage girl with a black dress holding a knife at the edge of the woods, you must run the other way, because she is extremely fast. Okay, guys, those are the tips to survive Jane and Jeff the Killer. I hope you all enjoyed. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you on the next one. Have an amazing day, and... Bye-bye, and shout-out to our subscriber who wanted me to do this. Follow this YouTube channel. See you on the next one. Have a good day, and bye-bye.